<laughs> G'day and welcome to our super quick guide to get you started with your Canvas courses. There are heaps of other awesome features that we'll obviously cover at a later date, but for now let's focus on getting them off the ground, uh, where we'll create some pages, we will change the home page layout, and we'll publish the courses. All right, so here we go. As we go into our uh, Canvas area, you'll see there's the courses at the left. So you click on the courses you want to go to. All right, and a blank course will look like this. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to add some content via pages. We are then going to change the home page layout, and then we're going to publish the course. So let's do the pages first. As you click on pages, you'll end up at a blank home page or front page from your, uh, wiki, uh, from your site. All right, and over on the right, we go to edit this page. Now you can add in content, or over on the right here, you can put files and images and assignments, all sorts in there as well. So I'm just going to, I've actually got something already copied, so I'm just going to paste it. Year 8 Maths 2013, blah, blah, blah. And in here, I'm just wanting to put a little graphic as well. So I'm going to go over into images on the right. And I've already uploaded an image, but you can upload a new image or you can just embed an image that you've already uploaded in. All right. And down the bottom, I'm going to click save page uh, changes. So what we've done is we've added some content on the front page. All right. Okay. So the next thing I'm going to do now, I'm just going to go back home here at the top left. Uh, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to change our home page so that the front page is actually that page I've just created. So to do that, we go change home page layer. We click on that. And what we see here, we've got the option at the moment. It's an activity dashboard. I prefer to have a page I'll design by myself, the one I just did. Okay. You can experiment with which one you want to do here, but try that for starters, a page I'll design by myself update the layout and now when someone goes to that page it'll actually have uh, it goes to our site it'll actually have that as the home page instead and our last step here is we want to make sure we want to publish the course so you see here there's a, bu a button only teachers can see this course until it's published when you click on that all right you've got the option of publishing the course which now means that your students when they go to their courses they will see your course pop up in theirs Okay, so we've done a simple creating a page, changing the front page, all right, and then publishing our course. So what I'm going to do now, just to finish up, I'm just going to add a couple of other pages, all right, into this area. So here you'll see over on the right is create a new page. I know the first two topics I'm going to be doing is algebra for one, all right. So I'm just going to create a new page called algebra, all right. All right, algebra page. I'll just write a heading there for someone to work on it later. All right, but the difference this time is I'm actually going to make this so that, see down the bottom here, at the moment only teachers can edit the page. I'm going to let my students edit this with me. So I'm going to go teachers and students can edit it, and I'm going to save my changes down the bottom here. So what I've got now is, as well as my, um, so when I go to pages on the left, Right, as well as my home page, I've also got an algebra page over on the right here as well. So the last thing I'm going to do, so I sort of use my front page as a table of contents. So here where it says uh, what we're going to be doing over this year, I'm going to edit this page now. And I'm going to, here where it's got here is what we were doing this year. I'm actually going to put a link through to that algebra page. So I'm going to use this page as a table of contents. All right. So um, I, all I do to do that is I just, when I'm typed here, I just go over on the right and I just click on algebra and it'll automatically put a link in for me for the first algebra topic. All right. And I save changes and now my front page has got a menu what's going on and as we get to a top each time I create a new page each time and I add it into the menu and when you click on that you'll be going through the algebra page that's editable by students as well if I want okay and the top right here back to your front page so eventually you can end up with a whole lot of linked pages together right it'll make up a big part of your site so well done enjoy